Ah, oh, my lord. I can't believe it. We're so tiny. Look at me. I'm smaller than a brewing stand. Oh no. Oh my lord. I'm so scared of these things now. I'm so scared. <laughs> I need to wear something gold. Because oh, if I get attacked by anything now, I'm screwed. This is where I live now. Uh, no, you do not. Your what hair is I very die? fluffy. What are you going to do? I'm going to go jump in something. I'm going to go jump in the water so you drown. How do I get off? <laughs> look Look what you've done. There, there, there we go. go. Can I? controller. Chicken, shift. where are you at? Can I do this to you? No. You punched it. My yeah, chicken. see, I see. I just hashed that chicken. You know what? That's what I accidentally did to Fred. And now look. Yeah, at you want to talk about it? No. Da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. I hate you. <laughs> I was like, you're still near me. I thought I just left you. Good lord. Bye. Bye, good luck. So, uh, yeah. Uh, well, welcome back to another episode from the Origins Trinity server. And in case you haven't noticed, <coughs> I am extremely tiny now. Like, look at this. When I jump, I, can, I can't even jump an entire block tall. I can't climb things, though. Look at this. I can climb. I can stay on the wall. I'm like a spidery boy. Oh my goodness. <laughs> it's a whole thing. Do you, do you have any idea how terrifying the nether becomes when you're this small? I was not prepared for this. Oh my. And Fred. Oh dear Fred. That was just a complete, complete disaster. Now I did get some help from Frecklestow to get some of my stuff. She accompanied me to my base. So I have a whole bunch of stuff and things. So I think we'll be okay, but this is a little bit of a do-over. Um, I uh, fortunately I didn't have to use my did you die box, so that's still uh, over at spawn hidden somewhere. But yeah, so this is our new home. This is going to be the mansion. This is the great hall in the front, and uh, we currently have a temporary space in the back for all my junk. Because even though I'm tiny, I still have a lot of junk. Now on the outside, it looks a lot better. Yes, so this is Tall Jack's mansion. Um, that's what it's called here. Uh, it's uh, it's a uh, it's a little bit of a <laughs> it's, it's a very big place. At least at least at least to us at the moment, we have a pond in the back, some nice little vines. Oh, hello. Oh, that's a creeper. Uh, but here we have a tiny little space. It's going to be great. I think this is going to be absolutely great. And if you look at it from afar, let's fly up to Freckle's base because she's over here. Oh, oh it, there we go. You can see it's actually looking quite cute. Not gonna lie, it looks quite cute. So this is where we're going to live now. The question now though is what do we do uh, with our new base place thing because uh, we we uh, we're now tiny we're we're super tiny and I don't I don't get damaged by water anymore which is great absolute ow uh, yeah, there we go absolutely great however I only have like 5 hearts which is not much so I'm thinking that we're going to need to build out this uh, little base mansion thingy that we have started on here. And it's, it's kind of cute down here. It's very cute. And I think that it fits in very well with the overall aesthetic around here. So I'm thinking what if we build this into a larger tiny mansion? And then we kind of blend it into the village. We might redo some of the village stuff. And we definitely need a bridge going up to Freckles because it's a little bit of a pain if you're walking. So I think our first order of business is going to be mansion time.
just like that, most of the stuff is actually done. Now, I have not done any interior so far because uh, I, I'm not very... Well, I'm not feeling that today. However, it has been about a week since... Well, actually, it's been more than a week. It's been like one and a half week since the last clip um, because... A whole bunch of stuff happened that I had to attend, and time went by, we had a lot of visitors, and it's been a whole thing. So, uh, we finished finished some of this stuff. This this tower looks ginormous from here, being this uh, this tiny. And we got a couple of um, got a couple of buildings built. Now maybe I should fly on top of the tower. Right. <clears throat> that didn't work very well. Let's see. Let's try again. Let's try to land on top of here. Like so. Nice. So we got a building down there, building down there, and a dual building down there. And then of course we have our lovely tower. Now, the tower is actually uh, quite nice inside because I can go all the way up. I can do that without the ladder as well, but I figure that if I die, I might as well, might as well have it. So, up here we have a little bit of a view. It's beginning to look quite nice. I would like to expand more this way. So, I want a building right there. Uh, and then, of course, we are going to want to redo the fields. Put some more crops in here, maybe some potats, maybe some carrots. Gotta move the uh, melons somewhere else. But yeah, I, I think I think Tiny Town is uh, it's kind of getting there. Now these these houses, I've tried to not make them too uh, what do you call it? Too normal. <laughs> I don't want them to be super square. Oh, excuse me. Um, I don't. I want them to be kind of organic shaped. It's uh, it's a little tricky to work with, as you can see in the time lapse. It kind of takes a while to get the shapes right and all that kind of stuff. Uh, and and with all of the chimneys, it's kind of nice. I like the movement that it adds. Minecraft still needs a lot more movement. We'll see if we can do anything more about that. Oh, and I can feel that my throat is really not happy with me today. But we'll work with it. We'll work with it. And at this point, I'm not actually sure if I viewed this, uh, reviewed this, showed you guys this. So Freckles and I kind of started on a little bit of a, well bridge outlay uh, they're supposed to be they're supposed to become a bridge down here eventually with a path going all the way up there and then i think she wanted her library to be inside of this cave um something like that so we uh, we might have a look at doing some some work on that as well but i don't think that's going to be today um, because it's been a while now and i need to get this episode out now you can see at the end here at the bottom I've added a whole bunch of bricks and stuff because we need to make like a uh, tiny little retaining wall and put some uh, put some more vegetation down. We need a thingy for our portal to make it look nicer. And yeah, I think that's going to be for next time because I am not quite sure how much more I'm going to be able to cram into this episode it's already been over a week and a half with not being able to do much and uh, I would like this to actually come out at a well I'm not allowed to say a reasonable time anymore because it's been quite a while but you know what I mean right you know what I mean and with that I actually think I'm going to round it off for today because well like I said it's been a long time I would like this episode to get out even though it's going to be Quite a lot shorter than normal, I hope that's okay. I promise that next time we'll do a lot more. We'll have the retaining walls down here to work on. We have a couple more buildings up there, some fields to fix and all of that stuff. Maybe we'll go and check on check on Freckles, check how she's, she's doing up there, who knows. And, uh, and yeah, I, I think... Bleh, bleh, ooh, I can't fly anymore. And I think... We are really getting somewhere 
with Tiny Town. Oh, I can't forget about the portal either. We need to do something about this. We need a uh, we need a uh, portal thingamajig that goes all the way around here. You know, that kind of stuff. So I think that we're going to call it for today. It's been absolutely great to come back here. I'm looking forward to getting all this done. And that's it for now. Bye-bye. Out.